Good morning. Hello. We are back for another one early this morning, guys. I was, I had just finished getting lunch together for my husband. He just left for work. It is Thursday morning and it's right at 730. So not super early anymore, but um, like any good mom, you know, I had to get my, my stuff done before I got back up here in the office to get up on this. Uh, but, you know, I noticed that our senior mamiana, Mama Dukes, is back up to the shenanigans again. Or maybe it's Jasmine. I don't know. Is this Mom Dukes or is this Jasmine or is this Baby Mom Dukes? Uh, maybe it's Baby Mom Dukes, which is AKA Jasmine, because this is absolutely ridiculous guys so this is what i noticed let me show you a little bit closer and then we're going to jump right into both of these videos and if it's too long this is going to be part one and part two so let's just see how this pans out um so mom dukes right here has two new videos one decorating for decorating for christmas cooking okay um then shop with me for a mother of four under eight vlogmas day whatever i don't even know but apparently jasmine once again is using her mother to continue the narrative about amaya's birthday and her failure to produce i guess a cake and a meal because allegedly jasmine ran out of food stamps or her food stamps are being investigated and she also kind of neatly set up for chris to actually potentially be the fall guy for maybe even having grifted her food stamps i don't know we don't know what happened but i know that i that i I want to say I almost stumbled across this video, but yeah, I didn't stumble. I am subscribed and my notification bell is on. I started watching this one. I think I got about two minutes in when I realized, oh yeah, I need to go ahead and watch this. So, um, but I almost feel like let's start with this shopping vlog because this is probably what Jasmine is using to talk about in some kind of way how she, how her mother went food shopping for her when she ran out of food stamps. So let's just start watching this one and see how this goes. I'm just going to say this right off. I don't know if HEB has a weight requirement on those scooters, but Mom Dukes alone, I think, is sufficient for the scooter. But when you add a set of twins who probably weigh at least 20, 30, I'm sure they weigh at least 30 ish pounds a piece, 30, 30 something, um, maybe close to 40 pounds. Um, is that, I mean, that's, that's a lot. And I don't know if Amaya was riding on the back at once or it was Amaya. And I mean, my gosh, the, you putting a hurting on them scooters and that's not what they're intended for. They are not a ride at Disney or at SeaWorld. These are scooters to help you food shop, not props to vlog Jasmine. Okay. My goodness. It's like she doesn't care about anybody else's property. Let's just fast forward a little bit. Mom Dukes, put your mask over your nose.
So what do you put them in? You can put them in there just take them out and them out. Take them out. I never take them out, but that makes sense. So I learned bananas some time ago, but I'm like, I just bought these bananas. Yeah, they, they'll go. I, I learned that from HB. I'm working with HB. So you want to put them in there? No, leave them out then. Because I didn't know that. <laughs> Here you go. What, the bananas go bad if you keep them in the plastic bag too long? Aiden is like, please don't film me. Please, please don't. I don't want my, my face in this. For my babies. Why... Why are you buying already patted meat? I mean, those, I don't know, even if they cost three to five dollars for those ground meat packs, why not just get a big, I mean, look, you're on a budget, get a tube of meat, okay? Get a tube of ground beef. I don't understand what's going on. And Mom Dukes, I see you uh, over there with the never fall um is that one of jasmine's bougie on a budget bags that she gifted over to you or um did you did you drop a stack and actually get yourself a little some of them are such good copies you really can't tell um but yeah and y'all y'all got them hand sanitizers attached to your purses jasmine's bag is like a utility belt over there you see that guys let's keep going Look at this. All kinds of stuff that's already seasoned. Jasmine, is she shopping for you? You don't have Lowry's or some accent or some Tony Sacheries. You can't season your own meat. That costs extra. So you want to know why your food stamps ran out? I mean, you're going to put, I mean, first of all, you don't get to wash that meat. If you wash it, guess what? The seasoning comes off. Why are you paying for already seasoned meat? More pork. Let's go ahead and get these pork chops popping. Where's the chicken? Well, you got chicken wings. Oh, look at those little tubes of tur ground turkey. Y'all, stop playing. Look at that. You got the Jenny O turkey trays right there. You got the ground beef. Look, let's go back. Y'all, hold on. Look at that ground beef, two sixty nine. I don't know if that was two sixty nine a pound. That might have been for that whole tube. Look down here, the turkey trays, three ninety six. She just picked up these small ground. Uh, I don't know if that was ground. Is ground turkey? How much were those? I mean, come on, y'all. This is ridiculous. But you know what? This is the kind of stuff that happens when you come on here uh, trolling and begging for money. People are going to start counting yours or trying to figure out how you're spending. I mean, okay, so looks like you're getting your whole refrigerator filled up. So in response to um, the food stamp office, yeah, you've got someone who's contributing to your household. This is a whole... Um, this is a whole week of groceries for a large family. I mean, look at all this meat she's buying you. This can't be for just one meal. And if we catch you and Chris out there barbecuing again, all this food and mukbanging and eating it all up in one night. Yeah. You don't need anything. Okay. You guys can do what you want to do, but when you come on here crying about missing your food stamps or needing food stamps, girl, bye. roasted potatoes a bag of potatoes is like three dollars but you're gonna get one little serving tray of see y'all de depend too much on this pre-packaged food absolutely ridiculous and that i get that ground turkey that turkey uh turkey sliced turkey uh sandwich meat girl what are you gonna do with that small pack of uh turkey meat oh them kids don't need that uh sugar on them captain crunches i'm sorry uh, and Hawaiian punch yet yeah, get you some packets of Kool-Aid. Okay. Yeah. You see the lady looking back. Look, she was like, what is going on here? Look at that. She's like, wait a second. What is going on? Look at this lady's like, what is going on with the blue hair? She's like, I thought I was looking strange. One container of eggs. 
Oh, but the Starbucks creamer. Okay, Jasmine, you really needed that? Mom Dukes, get your belt and whoop your daughter. Okay, you don't have to do it on YouTube. I'm not asking you to do that. You need a gallon of milk, ma'am. Put them damn designer potatoes away. Get you a bag of potatoes that you can actually cook in a pot with some water. Oh, they're Parmesan and uh, roasted garlic. You don't have garlic and Parmesan cheese. And that little thing of, of orange juice, Chris probably will drink that for lunch. Mm -mm -mm. Y'all love pork. Mm -mm -mm. Jasmine, you should be ashamed of yourself. Your mom was talking about she was on hard times. I wish I could show you a financial statement or whatever that case might be. And you have the nerve and you see how you shop with your mother. That shopping trip that you did with Chris was ridiculous. What was that you said, Jasmine? You always putting a note in somewhere. I'm so B for my mom's help. I'm so B. I'm so blessed, maybe. I'm I'm sober for my mom's help. I'm so beyond shame for my mom's help. Which one is it, Jasmine? But this is not how you shopped when you went shopping with Boothang, wasting all your food stamps buying $11 a pack water. Yes, yeah, someone commented and told me that essential water is like 11 something, 12 something for the pack that you purchased. So $24. So $24 of designer water for that bum. I'm gonna do something again. I'm closing this video out. Vlogamus. Mom Dukes, your curls are popping though. Yes, all that. Thank you. For being a part of my Mama Duke's game. Love you all. Yes. See you on the next video. Peace. Mama Duke. How y'all doing tonight? Okay. Up next. Mm. I love a good soup. Okay. We're going to get to that in a minute. Um, Y'all. Look at Jasmine's shirt. Naughty, nice. Is it whatever? Or or what the fuck? I don't know. Anyway, guys, I'm going to wrap this one up. And I'm going to watch the next one. I think this went a little bit faster than I thought it would. So I'm going to go ahead and get this to you guys ASAP. And then I'm going to get on the other one. So anyway, guys, um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think down below. I mean, is this not ridiculous? Does Jasmine... Did, can you compare how she shopped in that shopping hall with Chris versus what she picked up? Even though she picked up a lot of processed food, she picked up more food that I could see her lasting a little bit other than the obvious mistakes of buying prepackaged potatoes, red potatoes. You could have bought a bag of those. Um, they sell them at Sam's for maybe five or six dollars and you get a lot. Uh, buying a little package like that, which I'm sure is like three, four dollars, you're probably getting about 10 potatoes that have been cut in half. So you get about 20, 30 pieces, maybe, which is like 15 potatoes. And they got you paying three or four dollars because they cut a piece of butter and put some seasoning on it, which you can do yourself and have like two, three servings buying it the way that you can season it yourself. You're never gonna learn how to cook properly if you don't start cooking because buying all this pre-season stuff is absolutely ridiculous. I don't, I don't know what you're doing, Jasmine, but you are wasting money and that is why you don't have any money, okay? That is why you are on food stamps. That is why you are dry bagging to your audience. 
So really I'm sure not- what the heck is going on over here. Guys, I'm sorry. I didn't have my camera back on. Um, but you get the idea. You get the picture. You know what's going on. Um, guys, I will see you in the next video and comment down below. Bye.